Leoluca Bagarella, a notorious figure in the Italian Mafia, was born into a family deeply entrenched in the criminal law underworld. His early life in Corleone, Sicily, was shaped by a culture where Mafia affiliations were often a way of life. The Bagarella family had long-standing connections to organized crime, setting the stage for Leo Luca's future path. Bagarella's entry into organized crime was almost a foregone conclusion given his family background. During the 1950s and 1960s, Sicily was rife with mafia activity, and the socio-political environment provided fertile ground for the growth of organized crime. The Mafia, deeply embedded in the social fabric of Sicily, wielded significant power and influence, often blurring the lines between legitimate and illegitimate activities. Bagarella began his criminal career under the tutelage of his older brother, Calogero Bagarella, and other prominent Mafia figures. His ruthlessness and loyalty quickly propelled him up the ranks of the Colleonesi clan, a faction within the Sicilian Mafia known for its brutality and strategic cunning. This period marked a significant shift in the power dynamics of the Mafia, with the Colleonesi clan emerging as the dominant force. Key events that marked Bagarella's rise included his involvement in the Second Mafia War, a bloody conflict within the Mafia during the early 1980s. His role in this internal struggle, marked by a series of murders and betrayals, solidified his reputation as a fearsome and uncompromising mafioso. Notable figures such as Luciano Leggio, Salvatore Riina, and Benando Provenzano were instrumental in Bagarella's ascension. Under their leadership, Bagarella became a central figure in orchestrating violence and maintaining the clan's power. Leoluca Bagarella, a key figure in the Italian Mafia, was involved in a range of major criminal activities that had far-reaching impacts. His criminal repertoire included murders, extortion, kidnappings, and playing a pivotal role in Mafia-controlled enterprises. One of the most significant aspects of Bagarella's criminal career was his involvement in murders. He was known for his ruthless efficiency and was implicated in numerous killings, including those of rival Mafia members, law enforcement officers, and anyone perceived as a threat to the Mafia's interests. These acts of violence were not just about eliminating opposition, they served as a message to both the Mafia community and the public, reinforcing the power and reach of the Mafia. Extortion was another hallmark of Bagarella's criminal activities. Businesses, both small and large, were often forced to pay a pizzo, a form of protection money, to operate in areas controlled by the Mafia. This practice had a crippling effect on the local economy, instilling fear and stifling economic growth and innovation. Bagarella was also involved in kidnappings, a tactic often used by the Mafia to exert control or demand ransom. These kidnappings often had traumatic and long-lasting effects on the victims and their families, spreading fear throughout the community. The impact of Bagarella's crimes on Italian society was profound. His actions contributed to a climate of fear and mistrust. The Mafia's grip on various sectors, including the economic, political and social spheres, hindered progress and corrupted the fundamental institutions of society. Communities lived under the shadow of the Mafia, with daily life often being influenced by the whims and demands of Mafia figures. Personal stories from victims and their families underscore the human cost of Bagarella's crimes. Families torn apart by violence, business owners forced into bankruptcy by extortion, and individuals living in constant fear of reprisal are just some examples of the personal toll. Leoluca Bagarella's capture was a significant event in the fight against organized crime in Italy. After years of evading law enforcement, Bagarella's reign as a notorious Mafia figure came to an end on June 24, 1995. His arrest in Palermo was a result of a meticulous police operation, following intense surveillance and intelligence work. Bagarella was known for his ability to avoid capture, making his arrest a major victory for Italian authorities. Following his capture, Bagarella faced a series of legal proceedings that were closely watched by the Italian public and international observers. He was tried for numerous crimes, including murder, extortion and involvement in Mafia activities. 
The trials were extensive and complex, involving a significant amount of evidence and witness testimonies, many of whom were former Mafia members turned informants. Bagarella's sentencing was a landmark moment in the Italian legal system's fight against the Mafia. He received multiple life sentences, reflecting the severity and multitude of his crimes. His convictions included involvement in the notorious murders of anti-mafia judges Giovanni Falcone and Paolo Borsellino, crimes that had a profound impact on Italian society and the fight against organized crime. Thank you for joining us on this journey through one of the most compelling chapters in the history of organized crime. Remember to like, share and subscribe for more deep dives into history's most intriguing stories.